Yeah, it sounds like a, a good idea, Diddy. You're involved with it. It sounds like something Liverpool can't really lose from. A youngster from overseas gets a chance to come and train and, and play at the academy. A win-win situation for the club. Yeah, absolutely. And I think the the, the, the reason behind this, um, it's very um, unlikely that a, a, a kid from England, Germany, Italy, um, is not being spotted when he comes to the age of 15, 16, yeah. 17, because people or, or kids get picked up now at 9, 10, 11 years. There's scouts everywhere. There's more scouts than players at times. So it's very unlikely that they not been spotted. And uh, I think if you go to places like Turkey or the Far East, I think there's a chance to um, to find a, a jewel and... Uh, you know, if they come over here, adapt to the life in England, and um, who knows, maybe uh, one of them kids will get found, comes over here and, and plays for the first team one yeah. day. I think there's no doubt that potentially in the Far East and, and Asia generally, there's, there's going to be more and more players that come out of that region and, and make it right to the very top, isn't there? Well, um, it, it, it depends because obviously, you know, when that player gets to a certain age, there are all kind of work permit issues. Mm. That's further down the line as to who can get work permits. I had a similar situation when I was coaching the Jamaican national team and I actually do some stuff with Digicel, which is a, a, a like Vodafone a, yeah. a, a company out in the Caribbean. That's what I was doing in the Caribbean. And we had a relationship with a, a Premier League club um, and some of the boys went to the Premier League club. They liked them, but they weren't able to take them because of work permit issues right. and, and stuff like that. So there are all those issues. but. Th th Everybody in those countries want to know, is a boy going to be given an opportunity to sign a professional contract and play for the first team? That's further down the line. It's all about giving that child an experience, the exposure to further his footballing career at a top Premier League club. Mm. That's what it is. And that's where we should leave it for this moment in time, not put pressure on the kid, because in the country he'll be being under pressure to then say he's going to sign for Liverpool. But let's just take it softly, softly.